Well, first off, um, you get the win. What do you feel like was the real difference? Seems like you guys were good on third down. Obviously, Tank Tank had a great night. <laughs> well, I don't know how many yards he had, but he Tank had a really good night. Uh, you know, Blue Valley did a good job uh, tonight preparing for us and, and tried to take some things away. So my hats off to those guys. It was a tough game. We had to work for everything tonight. I know in week one you kind of don't know what to expect. There's be procedural issues, some sloppiness. Did you feel like you guys played a, a relatively clean game, especially given the, the opponent, what you had to do? Well, given the opponent, you know, they're they're causing you to make some mistakes. But, you know, we had some things. Um, call them uh, growing pains, let's say, because I know we won't make those mistakes sure. next week. What do you feel like that was the key defensively to, to shutting them down, well, particularly they, the second half? Yeah, they our defense did a wonderful job after the first you know, quarter. And uh, it seems like every time we, you know, they just did a great job getting them three and out. And, and uh, we weren't back in the huddle very long is what I'm trying to spit out here. And then we were back on offense. So. Uh, I'd have to watch the film. I didn't get to watch most of it because they were doing such a good job getting them off the field. Sounds good. I guess, first off, what do you feel like the difference was there? I mean, second half, you guys seemed like offensive rhythm just wasn't there to, to close that gap. Yeah, we, you know, we just, we couldn't, uh, we couldn't respond to the conditions and, and to what they are uh, as well as we wanted to. Really, it started in the second quarter. Um, that, they went on a second quarter drive there right before the half that, kind of took some wind out of our sails and we didn't re respond well. Kids, coaches, any of us at all, um, we'll learn from it. Two turnovers defensively in pretty key moments, but then couldn't capitalize on points. Just talk about the defensive performance. I mean, it seemed like they, they kept you in the game, it seemed. Yeah, our defense battled and we had we were running kids on the field that hadn't taken varsity snaps all week just because we were cramping so bad. Um, and those kids came in and, and fought. Um, Aquinas is huge. They're huge, and in a game like this, it just wears on you. You know, it's slow death, Novocaine, and it's just inch by inch, and if you don't get them in a bad down and distance, you're, you're going to be in for a long night. Obviously, this is week one, and North comes to you guys next week. What's What's got to improve before next Friday night, do you feel like most? Well, it's a, it's a similar brand of physical football in that North will be extremely physical. It'll be a physical football game, but it's a completely different scheme. Um, and two teams that know each other really well and they're loaded with talent as well. That won't change in any week we play and every coach in the EKL will tell you this. So we'll go back to work and we'll get better from this. I don't know the, the final stats, but I imagine you're up around 200 yards tonight. What was the key to, to your success and what you were able to do? Just, you know, you got to read, run behind the blocks, you know. You got to just keep running behind the blocks. If they block, you score. Talk about opening with a team like Blue Valley and the statement that you guys were looking to make because obviously it doesn't get easier. Uh, uh, yeah. They tough. They're a football team. They came to play. They punched us in the mouth, but we fought back. They're a good team, though. They play hard. Obviously, this is game one of your sophomore year, but what do you want to keep doing and achieving the rest of the way? Oh, just keep getting better. Only key, keep getting better. Faster, quicker.